Good morning, Floki. It's so magical right now, like a little winter wonderland. Oh. Apparently this area used to get a lot of snow, but nowadays this is more normal, um, but I'll take it. It's so beautiful. <laughs> play with inside. There's so much to see. I keep my house pretty cold during the day so I wear this and like extra layers. I have my winter trousers on which you guys have seen in like all of my videos lately and I get comments about them. <laughs> People are like, are you wearing trousers made out of curtains? <laughs> I mean, I guess they could be from curtain material. But they are super, super warm, wool, thick material, so they are amazing for winter. I don't really care about clothes. They, they just need to function for me. <laughs> Little boy, you came to play? So you guys probably recognize this room. I have organized it in other videos and it's where I keep all my art supplies and shipping supplies and everything. And as you can see, it is temporarily converted into a fortress. <laughs> but basically this is Floki's room. He sleeps in here and he just needed a safe, warm place to his for himself so Vader wouldn't bother him at night. <laughs> And that makes it a little difficult to access my stuff. 
uh, but my shipping supplies are are more or less open. So yeah, let's just grab a few things and we'll go ship some orders. Oh, Floki, no! Jeez. <laughs> If you are tight on space, um, I put my printer on this rollable cart thing. I think they use it in warehouses or something. I don't know exactly what it's for, but it's perfect for my giant printer. And it means I can roll it out of the way if I need to, or move it to the other side of the room for whatever reason. Um, but it just kind of lives under my desk for now. I'm currently in the process of saving up for lots of new storage systems for this room. so. My space will be better. <laughs> is negative four out <laughs> which is nice and crisp and it makes walking to the post office invigorating <laughs> I'm walking on these really slippy bits. I always think of that one scene in Still Game. <laughs> Jesus, he's all right. Watch your feet, Jack. It's slippy. <laughs> it's a pair of these you're wanting. Permagrip, 1999. <laughs> That boy at Timson's getting kicked squarely in the nuts. <laughs> Pharma Q. Hopefully that won't be me. So now I have a backpack full of groceries and a bag. I swear I always do this to myself. I go to the post office and I'm like, oh, I'll just pick up one or two things like spinach or eggs. And I end up with bags full and I'm overflowing and I'm sweating all the way home. By the way, fun fact, in Scotland, um, they say messages instead of groceries. So if you say, I have to go pick up my messages or, you know, did you, can you pick up the messages on the way home from work or something like that? It means groceries. The more you know. I'm gonna ice skate the rest of the way home. <laughs> it's nice and slippy. I have to show you guys something. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. <laughs> okay, but I need to do a bunch of things. I need to record my Patreon newsletter slash audio podcasty thing. And then I need to start planning my next YouTube video. And then I have to do some bookkeeping because I didn't do that on Friday. And this little boy is distracting me so much because he's so cute. Look who just came inside. <laughs> Little Floki's so happy. He has a friend to play with. Good boy, Vader. No. <laughs> oh. It's actually nice that they are getting along so well so soon <laughs> because they entertain each other a lot.
You want some foods? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Poor little Floki. <laughs> getting a bath. <laughs> Today I wanted to talk about how I keep myself motivated and inspired during times when I'm super stressed out and there's so much going on that maybe doesn't relate to art or practice or anything like that. So how do you get through those times? Because it's easy to just let all the overwhelming things and the life stuff get in the way of progressing with art. Okay, I'm going to leave you with some Floki purrs. And if you are painting but you're uninspired, do study. Do something that will work. So I'm just having some lunch now and I'm about to stream on Twitch <laughs> and I always do this. Like the morning gets away from me and then I make lunch 10 minutes before I'm start I'm supposed to start streaming. So I'm like inhaling my food. <laughs> Anyways, I'll uh, see you guys on stream. <laughs> Such a good boy, and oh, thank you for all of that cat hair on my paintings. I just want to thank you all for taking time to watch my video and if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more. Stay safe and warm and inspired and see you next time.